Hey y'all, my face looks so crazy. This is like day five of the chemical peel and low key I'm kind of nervous because y'all look my face like broke out. And my face was clean, like clear before I started, but she said that that's normal. Like basically the peel that she used, like makes your skin like purge and bring everything to the front. So I'm trying to trust the process because I look absolutely disgusting. And I'm hoping that these bumps don't take a minute to go down, but I ain't never had no peel like this. Like this one is really different. And like, y'all can't even see it on here. Anyway, I'm just trying to trust the process. Anyway. Today's Friday. Today is Black Friday, actually. I've just been editing all day, applying for jobs. I'm trying to get on a strike, y'all. I'm trying so hard to get on a strike. My current assignment, my manager, she was like, because I haven't got my flu shot yet, they been hounding me. Not because I want to get in. I'm just like, it's not a priority for me. And she was like, if you don't have it by the fourth, they're going to terminate your contract. And I'm kind of thinking to myself, like, I might be cool with that because then that way I could just go on a strike without having to worry about nothing. Or... I could just hit go ahead and start my assignment in California. Y'all get did I tell y'all already? I think I might have asked y'all to give me like some um recommendations for hospitals to apply to or not hospitals, but hospitals that are actually good or areas that are good in California. And also if y'all have like a good recruiter or an agency that I can go through because I'm very adamant about going to California um next year. But anyway, I just been editing all day. I'm trying to get this vlog out for y'all Sunday. I've been doing very good if y'all been paying attention y'all been getting two videos a week which i'm proud of myself for doing and then i'm going to work on the training we have a training coming up in two weeks which i'm excited about but y'all know i gotta get everything done for that but anyway i just wanted to come in and check in with y'all i feel actually good today um i feel really good considering because y'all know like the holidays are like really i want to say they're really hard for me because i think i'm just so used to being by myself but it's like my favorite time of year but also like the time of year where i feel like the most lonely because i don't have like family or you know people i can i don't have people that i can go spend time with my cousin actually who lives in georgia she did invite me over yesterday but i was so tired like i wasn't even sad yesterday like i enjoyed myself being by myself yesterday but i think it was because i had to work last night and so not last night but the night before and so I was just so tired that I literally slept all day. Um, and then I was watching like Christmas movies. Like I felt good. Like I wasn't like feeling like usually I'm like sad and down and out because I'm like, oh, what should I be with my family? But anyway, child, I've been okay. I've been fine and I have just been chilling. I'm going to clean up my house today. Um, I'm trying to sell stuff. We'll talk about that later because we have so much stuff to talk about, so much stuff to do. But today my focus is finishing this vlog and then uh, I'm just probably going to, I want to go work out, but she said I can't even work out. I can't do Pilates. I can't do nothing. I don't even want to go outside the way that I look. It just looks disgusting. Like, I know that I got to trust the process and it'll be okay, but her pill is completely different. Like, it was like, it's like a 10 day process, but it was like two days of her putting the pill on back to back. I think I recorded it. And then I'm supposed to chill for five days, but I was supposed to go see her today, but she was like, let's just do one more day of pilling. Um, because I only been washing my face once because it was kind of like raw and I, I just didn't want to like aggravate it more. So I was just was washing it once a day, which I feel like was making the peeling come off like less, like the process slower. But I'm going to try to trust the process child because this shit looks disgusting. Like I got a whole bunch of whiteheads now, all it is. And I'm like, usually when I get bumps, they leave marks. So I'm like, I hope all of these new little bumps is not going to be more marks. Because then I would defeat the purpose. Because I'm trying to get rid of all my dark spots. But anyway, I need to drink some water too. I'm going to drink more water today. But anyway, I just wanted to check in with y'all. I'll probably see y'all, I don't know, when, whenever I feel like, I guess. Come and talk to y'all and say hey. Bye. Oh my God, I only have four minutes of storage. Hey, y'all. It is um Thursday. Y'all, I'm doing Vlogmas. I don't know if y'all have noticed. I'm posting all of my old footage first and just breaking it down. And then eventually y'all will catch up to like real time. But I'm about to get out of here. Today on the agenda, I've been editing all day. Like my videos for Vlogmas. Today is December 30th. So I'm going, I mean not December, November 30th. I'm going to start posting tomorrow. I already edited two vlogs. They're up, ready to go. I'm trying to do like day one through seven. Um, so I don't have to worry about it because I have a lot of stuff to do next weekend and I don't want to be like stressed about that. Um, anyway, today on the agenda, like I said, I was editing 
I'm gonna go back to the um dog store because I feel like they played me on this bag. Like the bath is bag is half full and they're like really hard. Like I give him dry dry freeze dry food. Um and I'm they need to exchange this bag out. So we're gonna do that. I'm going to go get my blood tested. I don't know why I don't know what my blood type is, but y'all, I wanna start eating based on my blood type. I've heard different things about it. Some people say like it's foolery, there's no such thing, and some people swear by it, but I feel like it's no harm for me to try it because it's not like they're telling me to eat McDonald's every day if I got type A blood. So I feel like it's not going to hurt to try it i just want to kind of see like what the results will be um and then we're going to comcast to drop off they crusty ass um equipment because i canceled them because my internet is trash so i switched back over to at&t i need to switch my phone over too they bam they really got me because why would i switch from verizon to comcast like the man was like oh your phone bill only gonna be 45 dollars and i'm like oh okay bet not thinking Comcast not even one of the biggest providers for phones. So why would I even do that? So my phone service is trash, but I'm going to switch back over to Verizon. And then what else do we need to do? Go get our blood tested, drop the stuff off to Comcast, and then take this stuff to the dog store. I got Pilates around 420, and then I'm going to go get a facial. Y'all, I guess I'll show y'all my face. Well, I can show y'all a little bit, but we'll talk about it when I get there because it's stressing me out. Bye. All right, y'all, so we got the bag with no problem. I got him chicken this time. Sometimes he don't like the chicken, but child, he don't eat what he eat. I try to give him a variety of food because I feel bad for him because he eat the same shit every day. So I try to mix it up and stuff and make it, I don't know, nice. But anyway, now we about to go to Comcast, so let's go. All right, y'all, so we're here at Comcast. Comcast. I, um, I changed my service from Comcast to at and I had at and when I first moved down here. And it was okay, but I was like, oh, Comcast is known for, like, their internet, so let me switch to them, but Comcast is trash. It's, Comcast has always been trash. They just monopolized the whole internet industry. But anyway, I'm about to drop off this stuff to, uh, I don't know if y'all can see it, to the UPS store, which is actually really close by. Um, but I switched back to ac and but when I was switching to com when I was cut my Comcast off, you know how they be like, oh, what's the problem? She like, oh, I wish you would have called sooner because we could have just changed your plan. They got a bet. They always got a better plan when you about to cancel. And I'm like, girl, I don't even feel like going through that. I already been changed over my internet. Um, just give me the information so I can drop it off. So that's what we got to do. I was supposed to drop it off last week. They said I got 10 days. I'm not sure if today is day 10 or not, but anyway, we got to drop it off now. Chilling with the Hana, showing off her body. She in love with Sosa. Girl, you just a daddy. Hey, I'm just dropping off some equipment. Uh, yeah, no, okay. Okay, that works. Okay, all right, thank you. I don't think they gave me nothing to give to y'all. They don't really give me nothing. I still ask you some questions. Oh, okay, okay. I love when my errands just get done like back to back to back. So that is done. Now we about to go to, uh, I can't remember where they sending me. They're either sending me to Quest or LabCorp. I got it on the paper, but we're about to go over there and get our blood drawn. I don't think I need it to fast. You don't need this to fast what type of screen. No, you don't need to. Um, but I'm excited to know what my blood type is. I've only had to get blood like one time in my life when I went, um, when I had surgery, like that was like three or four years ago, but I never asked them. And that was when I was in nursing school too. And I had never asked them, you know, like, what is my blood type? But anyway, let's go. I'm out of control. I just came from, can you see it? Woody's, these cheese steaks got me in a chokehold. And my ass supposed to be losing weight. I know that I've gained weight cause my stomach be sticking up. Come on, man, any day now. 
And then don't put your blinker on. My stomach be sticking out, baby. But I'm going tomorrow. We're going to go get a, um, I keep calling a colonoscopy. I ain't get no damn colonoscopy. I'm going to get, um, my colon cleanse. Now, I'm, I'm on this, like, whole health kick. I think I'm, like, trying to eat bad right now <laughs> because when I get my colon... I, not colonoscopy when i get my colon cleanse like i don't want to keep putting trash back in my body so i'm like let me eat all the junk that i want to eat now so that i could just start over fresh so i this is my second day in a row i got this damn cheesesteak and i'm like i was only gonna get half of one but he's talking about we don't sell half i'm like so now you forcing me to eat horrible anyway i'm about to go i was about to go home and work on the training but i'm sleepy I'm gonna take a nap and then um, wake up, go to Pilates, and then go get my facial. And then, depending on how I feel after my facial, I might come home and just do a little bit of work. I'll probably do a little bit of work until I fall asleep. Yeah, that's what I'll do. But anyway, oh, y'all can't even see me. Y'all don't need to because I look trash. Anyway, bye. Y'all, I'm proud of myself because Lord knows I had that. I ate that. I knew it was gonna give me the itis. I thought I ate that damn cheese steak. I had fell asleep. I set my alarm, but and the whole entire time, the little voice in my head was like, girl, it's a wrap. You ain't going to Pilates. And if you cancel the class, like 12 hours, within a 12 hour time frame that is, that is scheduled, they charge you like $25. And I'm like, girl, let's call it what it is. You don't have to pay that $25. But, as you can see, I am in the car. And we're on our way to Pilates, even though I do not. I haven't done Pilates in two weeks, really. It's been about two weeks. I stopped. I didn't work out because for that whole week that I um that I was peeling, you're not supposed to work out. So I didn't work out at all. And then I had to go to work and you know how it is. Once you fall off, you just fall off. So now today is like my first day actually. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Being back. <coughs> oh, I know I'm about to feel it. I know I'm about to feel it, so let's go to Pilates. I'm not even about to bring the camera in. I ain't about to try to get no footage because I honestly don't feel like it, but just trust. Trust me. Now, why would you make that wide ass turn? Just trust me when I say Aw. that uh, I'm going. Bye. Hurry up. We might just get our facial. Maybe it won't look that bad. <laughs> Don't try to hide now. <laughs> Maybe it won't look that bad if I look at y'all from a distance. I'm about to have her explain. Why are you trying to hide? Oh my God. I'm about to have her explain why my I look so depressed. Oh, Ooh, now that it's up close. Oh child, I don't know how we about to do vlogmas. I really don't. Meditation music, something to get you to. Do you need to do my? I don't care about my hair today. This hair is old. You still gotta put that on. You said you want to get the hairline. I'm gonna get in there, but you still gotta look aesthetically pleasing. <laughs> I can't look aesthetically pleasing with this face. Yes, you can. That face look good. Yo, she I swear this it. face look good. I see it, girl. It look like a travesty Please, to me. What if she would have come? I'm on for the next five days, so. Well, four days now. Now, y'all see all of these bumps right here. This is supposedly me purging. And I don't think I would have minded it. But the problem is that I scar easily. So now... I have to get rid of all of these dark marks again when I feel like I was making some progress. But come on, girl, stop whining. There's those are not dark spots. What is it? Just hyperpigmentation. It goes away fast. <laughs> What's the difference between dark spots and hyperpigmentation? That's only like the same thing. No, they're not. They're not deep in the dermal level. This just a little. Child, this is the opinion of me trusting the process because the way I feel, Put this on sis is tired and stressed. And that's why you no, these is from that dang on. 
They come around the jawline. Well, no, don't say that because I don't got none. Don't be stressed. Dude. <laughs> That's the way I get everybody. I'm like, okay, keep it up. I just haven't been looking in the mirror. What happens when cortisol rises? Cortisol? Uh -huh. Your stress hormone? Uh huh. Depending when, on what the person is. Where right? it come out at? It come out of your skin. Anyway. I keep begging you to stop it, but you're not listening. I got you. Did you turn the heating pattern? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. One off and one out. <laughs> uh, I'm a, uh, I don't know what we gonna do for Vlogmas. I'm vlogging every single day until Christmas, and they gotta look at me look ugly like this for the next 25 days. This is this is when people try to make you feel like you're delusional. No, I got eyes you don't have. Oh yeah. Oh my God. I'm gonna insert the um when I started off from day one until now, yeah. so y'all can actually see the whole entire process. I mean, did I send you a video this morning? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I've been documenting each day when my face is looking like so. I'm just curious when we get to probably day ninety. So <laughs> my face gonna be looking normal again. Girl, you gonna be looking like butter right now. Look at it. I this look it. like um when people have hair on their face, like PCOS. Mm -hmm. But I don't have that. You do have um. Uh, I don't uh, have PCOS. No, you don't have PCOS. You got um uh, folliculitis. Yeah. That's why I'm about to take the hair off. You got the derma plane? Mm -hmm. I got to go. That's not my progress. You trying to say I got a mustache? Mm, not quite, but yeah, you do have. I told you that. I you. Yo, when we get home, I'm going to do my hair because I can't, my face can't be ugly and my hair be ugly. So I'm going to try to do something. Anyway, bye. This is the finished product, y'all. That sounds so sad. <laughs> Hopefully there is a light at the end of the tunnel. And I'll be here to witness it.